JBN, we keep you informed. University lecturer, shot and killed in St. Andrew. Please remember to subscribe, like, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news item. Yeah man, greetings to one and all, you know. Name is Dean Makela, music rights analyst with a particular focus on the economics of music copyright. I'm here at home doing some masonry work on my house. You know, masonry as a vocation and the skills acquired. That's how I started out my occupational journey more than 20 years ago. So it may be surprising. The shooting death of a university lecturer in Lawrence Tavern, St. Andrew, on Wednesday night, as it left a number of persons, including an opposition senator, grief-stricken and devastated. The deceased has been identified as Dean McKellar of Paisley District in Border St. Andrew. The St. Andrew North Police are trying to locate the hoodlums who shot and killed the University of the West Indies Uemona campus lecturer. According to police reports, at about 9.50 p.m., Residents heard explosions coming from a section of the Lawrence Tavern area and the summoned law enforcers. On the arrival, Makella's body was seen with several gunshot wounds. He was taken to the hospital where he died while being treated. Several persons, including opposition Senator Dr. Andre Horton, himself a U.E. lecturer, have been left devastated as the news of the tragic death of Makella circulated on social media. Horton, through a post on his Facebook page, shared that he last spoke with Makella following a lecture the latter delivered on an on intellectual property, trademark, copyright and patent earlier on the day he died. R.I.P. Dean, the country needs a purge. We can't believe Wednesday, Dean delivered a brilliant lecture on intellectual property, trademark, copyright and patent. It was well received by the students who were learning more about the applicability of their economics degree after which we reasoned about how Jamaica can earn more from these streams and how the country can move forward. We planned the next meeting for Friday to flesh it out. Only for you say, you can't make it because you're dead or unposted. The Senator bemoaned the state of murders across the country and urged residents to come together to coordinate efforts to minimize the senseless shootings. Jano youth, Dean a good good youth, and a man them shoot him. How long will this continue? Look like this world and make for good hearted people. We have to come together now and coordinate efforts to try to minimize these senseless shootings across the island, Orton shared. Several other persons also expressed their sorrow at the violent demise of the lecturer. Among them was another UE Mona Campus lecturer, Donna Hope, who, in remembering Makella, described him as a kind and supportive person. One of the good ones, kind, easygoing, giving, and supportive. I'm still processing the news of your death, Dean McCullough. My former student, friend, colleague, and just a truly good man. Tears are not enough, she posted. My heart bleeds when I hear of these positive, promising individuals who have, and who's contributing to society or nation, losing their lives because of some nah, leafy, not no sense waste man, commented one social media user. JBN, we keep you informed. Please remember to subscribe, like, share, Leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items.